Greetings, this is a follow-up to the video I made yesterday regarding Khabib and Connor and their behavior. And I forgot to mention something extremely important and something that I thought to elaborate more on. And that is the kind of trash talk culture, the internet culture of insulting versus a more traditionalist honor culture. And let me tell you something I actually learned during this very summer when I was in Visby. And a professor in history told me the following. That... Honor culture obviously was extremely potent in Viking Age Scandinavia. So if you look at Sweden today, this is not representative of what our true nature is. So anyway, honor culture was huge back in the day and in Visby they had actually laws saying that if you got insulted three times and you didn't retaliate, you got expelled. So the city council would actually expel you from Visby and Gotland if you did not retaliate if someone insulted you three times. So it was expected of you to retaliate if someone insulted you and if you insulted someone that also meant that you were ready to go toe to toe with him unto death. So that is the traditionalist or traditional Swedish Scandinavian Viking way of handling insults etc. And obviously something I see today, especially in the internet culture, I obviously love the internet, you can attain so much wisdom from the internet, but uh, something I really don't like with internet culture is the casual insult and uh, rudeness that many people have. And let me just say this, that an armed society is a polite society. Why is that? Yes, because if everyone is high capacity and can show you the error of your ways when you're rude, yes, then people will be less inclined to be rude. Now, obviously, if there are no consequences of your words, then people are more inclined to be rude. And extremely important also to realize is that words have meaning, words have power, words are more powerful than fists for example much more powerful especially in this day and age thinking that you can get away with saying certain things and saying oh it's just words that is not a legitimate excuse and here's the thing if you are in a situation where there is no camera no witnesses and no police it is up to you to stand up for what you say so therefore it might not be a good idea to insult random people because you don't know the capacity of the other guy. So, the best advice, and this is obvious to anyone who's been with me for a long time because I've been promoting honor culture for a very long time, but if you're a new guy, if you're a younger guy and you are into this sort of insult culture, trash talking, and perhaps you do that in, in the physical realm as well and you do it on the internet, just a heads up, uh, a warning, some words of advice from me here is that drop this immediately, you never know one day you will say something, you will say the wrong thing to the wrong guy at the wrong time and then that can have catastrophic consequences and then you can't say, oh you know what, it was just a joke, it was just words. You can't hide behind these things, you have to take responsibility for your actions and words are actions and everyone probably knows this yourself, words hurt more than fists for example, especially if you train MMA several times a week and you spar a lot, it doesn't matter if you get punched or if you experience pain in everyone every once in a while physical pain is not as bad as mental pain therefore words have a lot of power and words can hurt therefore you have to be able to back up if you are going to use words aggressively so anyway point being is that do not insult people that is not a good idea and you have to be able to back up your words if you do choose to insult someone and also you can't say it's just words because it isn't just words. That is a falsehood that you need to drop immediately. So to conclude, be respectful to others, at least those who deserve respect. Then obviously there are people who are truly horrendous people, such as the mainstream politicians of Western Europe at the moment. Yeah, they are truly horrendous people who enact grotesque crimes against their own population. Therefore, yeah, it's legitimate to say that they are not good people. But, generally speaking, be polite, be respectful towards other people. And then obviously if someone insults you and you can retaliate, yeah, retaliate. There is nothing wrong with that because you will retaliate. If someone comes up and punches you, yeah, you will punch back. If someone says some insult to you or to someone you care about, yeah, you can retaliate there too. It's absolutely legitimate to do so. You should never turn the other cheek. Uh, that is a falsehood that is not in tune with our nature. So, that's all I have to say about that. So, be respectful. XOXO. Boo.